Now, staying at ECU, the university is announcing updated graduation plans for the class of 2021. It will host multiple in person ceremonies. Not in your sides, Caroline Boyer spoke with ECU's commencement co chair about the plans. ECU will have three graduation ceremonies on May 7th for the class of 2021. The commencement co chair tells me the university plans to do whatever it takes to celebrate these students in person. It's not ideal. We understand that, but we felt like no matter what we have to do to make the ceremony in person so people can participate in that, it's just a big deal. University officials announced Tuesday that undergrads would be split into two graduation groups, one ceremony at 9 a.m. and one at 1 p.m. Graduate students will have a ceremony at 5 p.m. We heard from our graduates in 2020 and 2021, whatever you can do ECU to make this work, Please do it. ECU will also have nearly 520 graduates joining in on the festivities. We know that they they got robbed of their situation because of COVID. We're not going to be able to have the class of 2020 on the field, but we are inviting them to come back. We will have a set section in the stadium uh, for both fall and spring. But Dowdy Ficklin Stadium won't look like it has in past years on graduation day. The folks on the field will be socially distanced. That means that everybody that's in the stadium, as hard as that is to believe, graduates and family members are going to have an assigned seat and they'll be in a set group. Everyone will also be required to wear a mask. The commencement co-chair says these plans are a year in the making. Chris Dansbury is hopeful May 7th will be a special day for students. I think what people realize when you went a whole year without in-person events, activities and ceremonies, they just realized how important it was. Any student who wants to participate in the ceremonies must RSVP by Friday. Stansberry says he expects to announce more information about graduation next week. In Greenville, Caroline Boyer, 9 on your side.